so let's switch to the next task the next task is to print this table using printf command so again it's a very simple task so I will start by saving the file task 3 dragging the template copying the aim my name and let's begin so now here what we have to observe is that there are table it's like it's it has a fixed uh, width uh, table so whenever you see something like this where the call uh, the where the elements are uh, distributed in a column manner then you should remember that you will have to use slash t to uh, create that column width fixed column width so i will just show you an example how i'm going to do and always remember whenever i do any printf's i always go one line as one printf so this entire line that is roll number name of student marks will be my one printf statement so printf I will open the codes and if I just look at the test text then it is roll number first then I have name of student name of student and marks now I want them to be separated uh, by equal distance so what I use is something called as uh, a escape sequence called as backslash t so which stands for tab so what backslash t does is it gives us an equal spaced uh, width between the columns which helps in organizing the columns in the proper manner in the command line so let me just show you what I mean if I run this now you can see I have a um, tab separated uh, columns here now you may not be able to see the difference right now because I don't have any other rows so let us let us start by adding another row so I will just copy this paste it down here and go for the next row that is one row number one name of the student is John Doe and marks is 35 so now if I run this so you will see that I am missing certain things first of all I am missing uh, first of all I am missing the slash n after this so that it comes to a new line I run it again and you see, you will see that yes, it's it's coming on a line, but because uh, uh, the number of slash t's are not proper, it is not conforming to the width that I've specified. So what I do is, this is basically a trial and error method. So if one black backslash t doesn't solve the purpose, then you add another. So I will just add another backslash t and run it again and now if you see my roll number is aligned my name is aligned and my marks is not aligned marks here starts over here and it in the second row it starts over here so there that means i need to add one more slash t over here so i will just close this and put another slash t and run it again and this time if you see yes I have roll number name of student and marks all the three columns aligned perfectly now if you want you may add another few more slash T's so that 
the marks is a bit more uh, there is a bit more space between those columns so now this looks much better okay so now let us begin with adding another row so I will just add another row slash n slash n and I will just replace this by 2 and let's say my name Shibu and let's say 55 and run it again and here I have it now this is perfect uh, as far as uh, the construction of the table is concerned but I would like to take it uh, one step ahead by adding the border to the table now to add the border it is slightly tricky now to add it I will start with a printf command but inside the printf I'm going to use underscores to make the top border line so if I use this and run it you will see I do have the line but I forgot to put the slash backslash n and now if you see the top border is there but it is not extending till the place that I want so I will just put few more of these and run it again now it looks proper the same thing I'm going to copy and paste it below every line so now it looks much more like tabular form so it looks much more much more like a table now if you want to take it one step ahead you can even use pipes to box out each and every cell I'll just show you one example let's suppose I want to box out this I can use pipe over here and here and here and if I just run it so this is how it looks so I can add so this looks much better uh, as far as the table is concerned but I can go one step ahead by adding the um, borders to the cells also with the help of the pipe character so I will just show you one example I will add a pipe over here I will add a pipe over here and a pipe over here and somewhere around here I may have to change this once the program runs so you see I have the border now but this is not aligning perfectly so I will just have to add a few more uh, I will just come over here and run it again so this time it went a little ahead so I will just take it one slot back and now if you see I have a box shape over here with the help of underscores and pipe character so like this I can do it for all the remaining cells and this will complete the uh, problem the task for this particular example